conquer them, man. But one more, Isaiah, uh, Isaiah uh, 47, Isaiah 47, and it's like, uh, I will not meet thee as a man. Isaiah 47 is in there. Go ahead. This is uh this is Isaiah. This is Isaiah chapter 47, verse 3. Go ahead. It says, Thy nakedness shall be uncovered. Yeah, thy shame shall be seen. Talking about America, Esau, Edom. Go ahead. I will take vengeance. And I will not meet thee as a man. See? So he coming with nukes, full angelic power, and all the angels, man. You see? So you ain't gonna be able to buy your way out of this. You ain't gonna be able to shoot uh Yahweh Shah with a rocket and destroy him, hit him with a nuke and destroy him. Nah, man. He coming with full angelic power, man. They're going to be in control of everything, man. Esau, Edom, going to be so scared. He going to be so scared. Yeah, I was shocked. going to have to make a fight. But Esau, Edom, he want to conquer the Most High and his son. That way, uh, we won't exist no more. And Esau, Edom, won't go into slavery. And he feel like he can rule forever. If he do that, it ain't going to work, man. He and Edomites are done, man. But that's a thought price. That's the thought process of, uh, of, of the mind of the Edomite, man, and the craziness, man, yeah. of the elites, of these Edomites, man. They out of there, man. They think the technology they got is going to have them preserved forever, the rule forever, man. That's what they think, man. And they're going to use the technology they got to fight Yahweh Shah, man. You know, but it ain't gonna, he's not gonna be defeated. Craziness. <laughs> See, nobody's crazy. But do these churches teach that? That so called white man in this nation don't fight the Savior? They don't teach you that. I was telling this lady my job with all the uh, military, and I was telling her, I said, Lord willing, she get up out of because I took her to Revelation 19 chapter and showed her how, you know, he saw the king of the earth gonna have. His armor trying to fight, fight Yahweh Shah. Yeah, yeah. Like, Lord willing to get out of there, but I said, man, it ain't meant for our people to be in shit like that. Nah, bro, nah. It ain't meant for us to be in shit like that. Nah. Nope. She was a fake Christian, so she got quiet. Oh, uh, yeah, she was one of the fake yeah, Christians. Yeah, she got quiet, she was crazy. No, no, that's so bad. Yeah. She was one of the fake Christians. Yeah, because cause a lot, like nine times out of ten, man, you know, you hit her with that, and she looking at you like, I see it, but I really don't believe that. You don't believe? Yeah, that's the way, that's what it is, man. You see, our people are, are hypocrites, man. You see, they're hypocrites, man. You see? They claim they believe in the Heavenly Father and His Son, but when they come to read that word, they they be like, nah, I don't know about that. I believe some of it, not all of it. Really the term there, bro. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> see, that's what they come with. That, that, that uh, that fake Christianity vibration. Mm -hmm. They don't want to deal with the reality of the scriptures, man. So let's go to uh let's go to uh that's it on that. Okay. Let's go to uh James the uh the uh, second chapter and uh you can start at the 14th verse. Alright. <clears throat> this is James chapter 2 verse 14. What doeth profit, my brother, though a man say he hath faith? And have no works. Oh, what I say? What verse is that? 14. Started, uh. Okay, go ahead, go ahead. Let me see, let me see. Started at 13. 13. Yes. Alright. This is uh this is James chapter 2, verse 13. For he shall have judgment without mercy. That's Esau Edom, man. Okay, and two thirds because they don't believe in Yahweh Shemel Shah. They don't believe in applying these scriptures, man. They don't have faith in Yahweh Shemel Shah. Go ahead. That had shown no mercy. Mm -hmm. 
and mercy rejoices against judgment. So when we see the judgment take place on Esau and Edom, we're going to rejoice, man, because the mercy is going to be given to us. Lord, when we don't mend it and do it to the end. And we humbly say that. Go ahead. Verse 14. What doeth profit, my brother, though a man say he had faith and have no works? Question. See, see have faith, but have, have no works. You got to apply these scriptures. And these people that's in the world, they going to see you applying these scriptures too. They going to see you separate from them. Because they're going to be asking you certain things. Why you don't do this? Why you don't do this? Why you don't? They, gonna, they see it. You see, if you if you applying it and you got and you got faith, they gonna see it. They gonna start questioning you. Especially, especially remember they say when they do the little cookouts and stuff like that at work. Yeah. And they tell you they're gonna bring some pork and catfish and stuff like that, and you don't eat it. You're like, nah, I'm good. I'm not gonna yeah. Eat and you enough. start separating yeah, yourself. Yeah. Then they're like, yeah. I need, or or they throw a little little pizza party. You know what I'm saying? And you ain't touching the food or nothing. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They're like, what the fuck? Who don't like pizza? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Not realize they got pork all in it. Or you trying to stay away from it. Yep. You know, you staying away from it. Through faith. Through faith. And belief. Because you're applying the scriptures. Okay. That's part of works. See? Good. Go ahead. Can faith save him? Question. Go ahead. Verse 15. If a brother or sister be naked and that's the truth. Yep. And destitute of daily food, and one of you say unto them, Depart in peace, be ye warm and filled. See, but they destitute of food, you know, bread and uh, uh, clothing. They destitute, they ain't got nothing, but you tell them, Depart in peace. Go ahead. Notwithstanding, ye give them not those things which are needful to the body. What do it profit? Yeah, what do it profit? So what he's doing is comparing what's needful for the body, man. You need faith, and by that faith, you gonna have the works because you believe. See? Go ahead. Verse 17. Even so faith, <clears throat> if it has no works, is dead. See? Is alone. See? Even faith, <clears throat> if it have no works, is dead. Being alone, man. So through faith, you gonna you gonna have them works, man, because you believe. You see, you can't you can't have uh, works without faith. It don't work like that, man. In some form of fashion, if you believe in these scriptures, you gonna have them works, man. You are gonna apply these scriptures, and the people gonna see it. Even, even like uh, <clears throat> even like the, the so-called you know with the demons you start dealing with when you you're not doing certain things because there's certain days that you can't do certain things they start looking at you crazy yep. you know what I'm saying like, like not right? celebrating like you got Valentine's right. Day coming up yep. you don't celebrate that they're gonna be looking at you like what yep. or New Year's or uh, New Year's or or Thanksgiving Christmas Fourth of July yep. birthday they're gonna be looking at you man right they gonna look at you. You know, your immediate family, yep. uh, when you make that change, your immediate family gonna start looking at you, man. They gonna start saying you crazy. That's why it's Chris Brumpy, I'm paraphrasing that, uh, to the part for we can call them crazy. Yeah, yeah. Call them crazy. Yeah, that's true, brother. That's true. Crazy. Yep, you depart from wickedness, you become a prey, man. Yep. You see? Yep. Go ahead. Verse 18. Yeah, a man may say, though, Thou hast faith, and I and I have works. Mm -hmm. Show me thy faith without thy works, and I will show you thee my faith by my works. See? Because he believed through faith, so therefore he had works. Yep. So it's both of us. And that's what make you complete. Having faith and having no works, man. Because you believe, man. Why ain't, he, why ain't he coming around if it's such and such birthday? Yeah, why, why he, he why he hit the why he hit the clubs with us? Right, you see, because it tells you in Peter's you're not supposed to be doing all that, man. See, why he he think he's better than us? It's just it's just that I'm applying these scriptures and I believe in the heavenly Father's son. You don't want this man. You see, 
because I believe. You mad at me because I believe. And I don't want to be partakers of them heathen customs no more. Right? Oh man, you don't celebrate birthdays? So you don't give your kids no presents on their birthday? Nope. <laughs> yeah, and they look at you like you a demon. Right. right. Yeah, I had to break that down. My kids, they mother. Yeah. Let's take Joe's uh, first chapter. Yeah. I asked us how you think Joe lost his children. Yeah, right. celebrate their day. Yeah. What were they right. doing? Yeah. You know, they look at me like crazy, like, what you talking about? Yeah. Yep. And them birthdays, when you're reading the yep. scriptures, them birthdays, you had uh, uh, Edomites celebrating their birthday, and you had the Egyptians celebrating their birthday. That's a heathen custom, man. We don't do that, man. That's why Joe uh, family got took out. You see? They were celebrating their day, man. Nah, man. But people will tell you, uh, when you don't celebrate birthdays and you're applying these scriptures and they see that you're applying them, your works, they'll say, that ain't in the scriptures. <laughs> they'll yeah. say, yeah. celebrating, uh, 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 you uh, saying that celebrating the birthday is wrong, but that ain't in the scriptures. Right. And you tell them it's in Job in the day. Like, ah. But that just lets you know, man, how they don't get into the scriptures. Yup. Yeah. But right, even if you go to uh, Job and when it speaks on uh, they date, you go into it and you go uh, in the blue letter, it referred to birth. Once you go in the uh, meanings of it, yeah, it goes yeah. It's, it goes into birth. Yeah, but see, uh, fake Christians <laughs> or two third ain't finna dive into no blue letter like that. Nah, man, they ain't finna dive into the what? Dive into the what's that? Going into the Hebrew, they ain't finna dive into that, man. You see, that's why the scriptures say. In Hosea 4 and 6, my people are destroyed for lack of knowledge, man. See? That's why I said that, man. JK ain't finna be doing no research like that, man. They just wanna keep telling you that you wrong. Cause you got faith. You see? Go ahead. <clears throat> it says uh, verse 19. Thou believest that there is one power, thou doest well. Mm -hmm. The devils also believe and tremble. So, the spirits, Esau Edom believe. Man, Esau Edom, that's why, hey man, I'm gonna tell you something, man. That's why Esau Edom asserts out the scriptures. That's why he know, that's how he know that uh, we multiply when we uh, catching hell, you see? Esau Edom know that. That's why he's searching out the heavens and searching out the water, and that's why he shot uh, a rocket at the at the moon because they know Yah Bashem Al uh exists based off the works and the elements in the earth. They know that, man. But that don't mean that they're gonna pl apply the scriptures. Right, right, right. You see, right. they know when you look up that word believe, that goes into uh, 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 faith. So they do believe that it's the, the heavenly father uh, is real based off the works and the trees and things they see in the world. They do believe it through, uh, based off that because Esau reads something in the scripture and he'll go search it out and say, oh yeah, that's true. Right, right. You see, that way. But are they gonna apply these scriptures in their daily life and tell people this is the way to get salvation? Hell no, man. Hell, I'm gonna show you. Give me uh, Daniel 12 and uh, 10. Daniel 12 and 10. He said, The wicked shall do wickedly, but the wise shall understand. Yeah, come. This is uh, Daniel chapter 12, verse 10. Many shall be purified and made white and tried, but the wicked shall do wickedly. And none of the wicked shall understand. None of the wicked shall understand. It's on that. But the wise shall understand. It's on that. That was it on that particular. All scripture. right. So none of the wicked shall understand. Let's look up that word understand right there. And let's see what it goes into. Let me change this battery because it's about to go dead. 